It's only February, but we already have a few of the most exciting flagship phones for the year. The Galaxy S24 Ultra, the OnePlus 12 and the Asus ROG Phone 8 Pro. And you know, with so many new phones, we just had to see which one has the best battery life. So hold on tight as we have seven new phones on the table. First, the main star of the show, the Galaxy S24 Ultra with a 5000 mAh battery. Next, the Galaxy S23 Ultra from last year with the same battery size. The Galaxy S24 Plus, which this year has a bigger 4900 mAh battery, almost the same size as the Ultra. Then the popular iPhone 15 Pro Max equipped with a 4400 mAh battery. Next, Google's Pixel 8 Pro with a 5050 mAh battery, and then two phones with extra large batteries, the OnePlus 12 with a 5400 mAh capacity, and the Asus ROG Phone 8 Pro with a 5500 mAh cell. For these tests, we always follow some strict rules. First, screens on all phones are set to the same brightness level using professional equipment. And second, the battery health on all phones is at 100%. With this in mind, all phones are fully charged up, let's unplug them and start the very first test, which is web browsing. All of our tests that we do here in-house are done over a Wi-Fi connection, and we will let the phones run like little robots following the same script, and we'll now speed up the footage, and the video you see is a placeholder run that illustrates the results but it's not the actual test run. And the reason for that is that this test often takes 15 or 20 hours. So fast forward until we see the first phone to die and we flip it around and it's the Google Pixel 8 Pro. Time on the clock is 15 hours and 51 minutes. This is a decent score, but not great. And usually we consider very good scores above 18 hours. And if a phone goes above 19 hours, now that's great. So let's continue zipping forward. We now see the black screen right here on the OnePlus 12, which is a bit of a surprise considering its extra large battery. But let's write down the score of 18 hours and 14 minutes and move on. And we continue. The next phone to tap out happens to be the Asus ROG Phone 8 Pro which is another phone with a massive battery, but its score on this test is 18 hours and 27 minutes. So we're already in very good battery life score territory, but not quite great. So we still have a bunch of phones left on the table. So let's see which one will die next. And we zip forward until we get another black screen. And this time, this is the Galaxy S23 Ultra. Time on the clock, 18 hours and 57 minutes. And let me remind you that you can find all these test results over at our website, phonearena.com, and another battery test with the smaller Galaxy S24 model is also coming soon on this channel, so subscribe to not miss that. All right, it's all Galaxies and one iPhone left on the table. So let's see which one wins this test. Now, the next phone to tap out here is the iPhone 15 Pro Max. It finishes with a score of 19 hours and 20 minutes, which is very good, but not quite the best. So we leave the test running for a while longer until we finally see the black screen and surprisingly, it's on the Galaxy S24 Ultra with a score of 20 hours and six minutes. Now this is great longevity, but we still have the Galaxy S24 Plus on the table. This phone has gotten a battery upgrade this year and we have the Exynos version that seems to be particularly efficient on this test. So we have to wait until finally, this phone also dies with a score of the truly impressive 20 hours and 41 minutes. That is one of the highest scores we have ever seen. So definitely interesting. And here is a quick recap of all the phone scores once again in this chart. All right, it's time for our second test. And to this one, most of you can relate. This test is all about watching YouTube videos. We once again start from scratch, all phones are fully charged up and ready to go and we'll drain them completely and measure the time. And we'll zip forward once again to skip the boring part and stop right here when surprisingly, it is the Galaxy S24 Ultra which first taps out and the time on the clock is eight hours and 18 minutes. Samsung phones throughout the years have been typically underperforming on this test. We don't know why, but it just seems that other phone makers do a better job optimizing for YouTube. 
And this is confirmed by the next phone to get a black screen, and that is the Galaxy S24 Plus with 8 hours and 20 minutes. Yes, that's the very same phone that crushed the browsing test, which is now in the bottom of the ranking for YouTube video playback. Let's keep on going and see if there will be more surprises along the way. And zip forward until we see another black screen, we flip it around and it's the Galaxy S23 Ultra from last year, which scores 8 hours and 54 minutes. Once again, confirming the trend with Samsung phones and YouTube video playback. But let's keep on going and we fast forward time and stop right here when we see another phone tap out. So flip it around and that's the iPhone 15 Pro Max with a score of 9 hours and 45 minutes. Definitely a big improvement over the Galaxy models. But now we have three phones left on the table and we have to see which one will win this round. Fast forward and another black screen. Turn the phone around and it is the Pixel 8 Pro. And it finishes with a respectable score of 10 hours and 32 minutes. So in this test, it seems that the phones with bigger batteries will actually win it. And we have to wait for a while until finally, 13 hours and 29 minutes into the test, the Asus ROG Phone 8 Pro taps out at second place. So the winner for this test will be the OnePlus 12. And it also dies not long after with a score of 13 hours and 37 minutes. Very impressive scores from these two phones. And here once again, all the scores in the chart for you. Okay, so what is the big picture? Well, it's kind of hard to draw conclusions when you have so different results on both tests. Now, if you watch a lot of video on your phone, the numbers say that the OnePlus 12 and the Asus ROG Phone 8 Pro have far longer battery life than all other phones. But if you just use your phone for texting or browsing the web, well, then the surprising winner here is the Galaxy S24 Ultra and most surprisingly, the S24 Plus. And if you're particularly interested in the S24 Ultra, it does great for light to use, but specifically for YouTube video streaming, the battery is draining a bit faster than you might expect. So there you have all the battery numbers from all these seven popular phones. Now, would the success of the S24 Plus on this test swing you that way instead of going with the Ultra? And what is your battery life experience with these phones? Hit me up in the comments. Thanks for watching.